Hello, my friends. Uh, this is October the 28th, 2018. It is, and I'm reporting here from, I am pleased to report here from Grotniki. It's about 20 kilometers away from the second biggest city in Poland, known as Watch in Polish Lodge. Really is how we would pronounce that. Uh, I am not gonna say confirmation of my account on what I will suggest are two psychologists. Um, in a little bit, however, I will explain uh, what here is happening, what's going on. Uh, I claim to have encounter uh, yet another two psychologists uh, yesterday because according to MK Ultra scenario alone, uh, once I would start to suggest on how I would go after psychologists, this and that, uh, they would really want to know uh, where is it. Basically, psychologists in Poland would test me out and see whether it is really that I know that I remember so much MK Ultra scenarios. And people involved in it, or is this about something else? And unless they have lied about under MK Ultra, they have orchestrated scenario, which I did positively uh, recognized. I will not go uh, over. Uh, we have that thing right there. It's like a little. Uh, movement detector based on which uh, lights are operated here uh, so please I apologize for that and so according to the ZMK Ultra scenario uh, I did recognize two psychologists from whom however I did not get uh, a verbal confirmation that this two are a psychologists uh, because of following okay uh, what you're about to hear it's gonna be the audio recording uh, let me put it just like this um, lock here was uh, I'm not gonna say destroyed but according to MK Ultra scenario they have done precisely the same thing they attempted to guide me uh, in a lot of different issues there's gonna be another video another two videos I'm going to post in respect to not exactly this case here. One is going to be in respect to this case in which I will explain the whole event, the whole MK Ultra scenario, so you get the taste about uh, basically how this thing works, really how it operates and how easy you can make mistakes and get yourself totally ruined. Uh, and then it's going to be another video in which I'm going to relate uh, to the broken lock here that I'm going to mention right now and many other issues that all this stuff went on parallel so you're going to see just how easy uh, you can make a mistake how easy it is to make a mistake uh, to get lost in, in like ocean of issues uh, if you really don't know what you what is it you're doing and if you really do not remember properly uh, people involved in MK Ultra, uh, MK Ultra scenarios, and you're not capable to utilize, uh, you know, <clears throat> out of the MK Ultra box uh, scenarios, possibilities, and stuff like this, you can get in trouble so fast, so quickly. Um, why do I mention this thing here that uh, three days ago, a lock, the door lock was latch, if you want to call that, was uh no broken uh first of all i don't know how often you would have lock break off and not the key uh this is strange because most often it's the key that breaks not the lock but in this case we had lock that supposedly broke off that's at least what my roommate have claimed on I think it was Friday, but it might have been even Thursday, I don't know. Uh, and 
Well, finally, today is Sunday. <clears throat> today the lock was uh, finally was replaced, uh, repaired. Just now, uh, the roommate gave me the key, so I was able. I have my own my key back. So it took three days, uh, and within those three days, uh, a proof about my telephone. Uh, my telephone would basically play simultaneously I'm talking about Android which you see right there this Android would play uh, simultaneously and speakerphone from the Android and headphones whenever you would play audio on it and yesterday and I have to explain that because today the telephone is working properly again uh, properly again because the idea was to confuse me on some other issues which I'm gonna explain in a video separate this one they had something else in mind too today the 28 you see the time changed for one hour and they really wanted me to come out with stuff basically which they have done they did intrude in my telephone they have revised the telephone back to the normal status, meaning that they got a hold of the telephone at night and uh, they got a hold of other things too. Uh, and if I would go and make the statement that the time changed, uh, they could use that statement against me, suggesting that, uh, I don't know, that I am paranoid or something that Today was a time change, but this is so well timed according to MK Ultra, all this stuff. You couldn't you cannot believe how well these things are timed, okay? So unless they have lied me about the stuff I'm gonna talk about. So the telephone now is working, but I do have a proof that the telephone in fact was broken. They did not intrude my belongings only last night before the last night uh, but it did also before that and they did suggest it under MK Ultra that the door latch is going to be like this for three days because they would be deleting my stuff my stuff I have posted online uh, you know which I have uploaded to certain uh, clouds uh, and so on they're gonna go over and delete me basically everything and stuff like that so they really wanted me to make me paranoid and go out there and state to the people that uh, you know all kinds of issues that uh, time changed uh, somebody got a hold of uh, my watch and have winded the watch one hour uh, you know forward and stuff like this and yesterday they have orchestrated the scenario I'm about to get to, uh, which, unless they have lied to me under MK Ultra, will absolutely confirm uh, my account about uh, MK Ultra involvement involvement of two psychologists in my MK Ultra case. Uh, the first psychologist I would refer to would be a spouse from. A man whose age I would estimate would range somewhere in between I would say 60 and 70 something like this I would say okay uh, most likely I would go I would go with the middle I would say 65 but this is just really a guessing uh, this gentleman you cannot go wrong uh, you cannot make a mistake this is the first gentleman I am referring to this gentleman has got a hair that is like this color, like this blondish and a little bit reddish, but really blonde, polished man. Uh, this individual, according to MK Ultra, was born in the city lodge, and he is not the one who is a psychologist. It's his wife, actually, if, unless they have lied to me, is a psychologist. This gentleman according to MK Ultra scenario, lives in Grotniki and I might 
be able actually to even pull out of my head the location of his residence. I will look into it. I'm going to open some folders in here. I'm going to look into it and see if I can actually pinpoint his location in Grotniki. I'm going to try to do that. If I'm not going to be successful with this, I am going to ask a little bit around here uh, and see if people can pinpoint uh, his location because I need his confirmation about stuff I have stated right now. And it was really was last week I posted on a new site that I'm going to go after psychologists. And according to Anki Ultra, this would be a test on how much I remember stuff on that MK Ultra. I can tell you that I have passed this test with the flying colors. Uh, everything I knew, everything I memorized from MK Ultra in respect to this case, but it was an easy thing to do. Yesterday, it was a Saturday, finally I felt I have a day I can go and study in the nature, I can go and I can devote myself uh, to the nature, uh, spend day in the nature, I can go study, uh, basically walk with a telephone and just uh, go over audio recording which I have created previously myself, audio recording of Polish English. Uh, that would help me to memorize a little faster, okay. And so I did so, uh, but I have observed a silver Honda CRV on exactly the spot that was uh, where MKOTRO was presented to me, and I decided to go and a little bit investigate about this. So I headed to the direction where I saw to uh, a couple just going after the mushrooms folks you have no idea how many mushrooms are here at this time of the year people take the whole buckets of mushrooms i've not seen anything like this definitely in slovenia we don't have anything like that but surprisingly how many mushrooms people pick here in poland at this time of the year so nevertheless i go and i see this couple and they decide just you know to use under pretense to go and see to check uh, you know, like, uh, just ask you what kind of mushrooms are they and how much to see if they got anything like that, you know, just like a tourist, something like that. And as I go, and I, I'm not going to say no, I did not recognize them immediately, but the couple was very, very, you know, I knew immediately they were involved in the ultra now. The only thing I have to do is I have to figure out who these people are, what their profile is. Uh, what part of MK Ultra and so on, which is extremely difficult thing to do due to a variety of people that were involved in this thing. They did not involve only psychologists, psychiatrists in this thing, but they have involved a whole variety of people. Uh, mainly were not psychologists, mainly were not psychiatrists who dealt with me under MK Ultra, but psychiatrists, psychologists have other people, helpers, staff members from all sorts of backgrounds that would assist in MK Ultra. So a little mistake you can make and then you have a whole bunch of trouble. Uh, I did mention the issue with the telephone because what you're gonna hear is my recording of Polish English studying as I walk, uh, along which you're also gonna hear me uh, joking with them how the mushrooms, this kind of mushrooms uh, they're known as Turk in Slovenia, and they're definitely you cannot eat them. You can poison, you can get poisoned with them. But here in Poland, it's different. Here you can eat them, and that's all you're gonna get because this is basically what I get from this so-called refugees here, from this Kadiro team, that whose leader actually is a Valerio, that's a police officer from Minsk, right here below me. Um, get really nothing else than the problems really on every step of the way uh, this time a telephone was hacked to the point that imagine you walk around with the telephone you listen to your headphones and everybody gets to hear you walking around with a telephone what kind of music what do you listen what do you do this this totally sucks this is what was done this time and i have totally failed to turn out the telephone on time 
He didn't come to me because I didn't think about this. I had so many other things about, I was concerned about who these people are. Maybe I can get something useful for myself that I can use. And did not think about this thing. And had at the same time and uh, audio recorder and uh, telephone Android in the same pouch. And that's why this problem. Okay, so these people created me a big problem here, these Chechen people. Uh, it's a problem, a problem after problem after problem. These are not real Chechen refugees. This is really a team Kadiro Vladimir Putin is what this is. Okay, so in this audio recording, that's all you're going to hear. But like I have stated, uh, this is the case with the first couple. And then according to MK Ultra scenario, there would be another psychologist who would... There was a whole team uh, of people. Um, not all of them, uh, as far as I know, would be a psychologist. But this guy, I can say, might have also been, according to MK Ultra, this also was a psychologist whom I do not know. You understand? I said I do not know this thing here. Let me, uh, let me show you this. This is a Mazda 626. But according to the MK Ultra scenario, this is exactly the car, this older Mazda 626. You can even see, you can even see a tag number here from the vehicle. Okay. Somebody is busy with uh, um, whatever he's got to tell. Uh, just for the law enforcement purposes, um, law enforcement purposes, not uh, just uh, for the information. Uh, tag is EZGC167. Uh, I'm sure I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure I got it right. E like Echo, Z like Zgirsh, G like George, C like Charlie, and then it's 167. In the end, that would be a tag number of this old Mazda. Uh, according to MK Ultra scenario, this would be yet a second psychologist. Uh, again, these people. According to MK Ultra scenario, once I would mention psychologists, this is a scenario they would come up with to see how much do I really remember about this stuff. And I am going to remind you, my dear psychologists, if I would remember, this was the deal, if I would remember the scenario properly, which you know I did remember it very properly, you know, because I did follow exactly the instructions I was given under MK Ultra, you also would come out of the shadow and confirm that MK Ultra was real. to sort out the information about the Honda CRV. I want to process the information to see where can I classify them in order to get some sort of, uh, you know, basically, you know, anything that would uh, really help me out uh, that I could go back and get their confirmation about my account. Uh, because this is how I get the proofs about MKUltra. 
and I did get to the car and I do spend maybe I don't know maybe two three minutes I don't know thinking about who these people were it comes to me I go back I try to find them but they already are gone in the forest according to MK Ultra these people will return back on the trail uh, toward Honda uh, Honda CRV in about one and a half hour uh, but it was not their Honda CRV. There's a whole story that I have to create on this. Uh, it's gonna be one hour long, and I need uh, I need I need Windows Movie Maker. I need I need computer to make this thing. I cannot go and do this with Android. Play with it. Uh, it doesn't work like this. Um, so here it is. Uh, unless these people have light. These are another two psychologists I have identified. One is most likely again would be the wife of a spouse of this um, Polish man uh, whose age most likely ranges around 65, something like this I would say, and whose hair is blonde like this. I'm gonna tell you, you cannot miss him, you can't go wrong with him. But I do remember his face very well, and I also remember face of his wife, uh, who is a psychologist, unless they really, really lied wildly, uh, I claim this to be a 100% hit without even a slightest error, possibility. And then a vehicle, Mazda 626, which should already serve enough for me to recognize a second psychologist according to MK Ultra scenario uh, unless they did pull me uh, for the nose. Uh, I would not know how this individual looks like but I know the story, the MK Ultra story which I was told. Uh, this he and his wife supposedly came on a visit to the friends right there uh, this car was parked about maybe 10 meters away from Honda CRV. So there's a whole story I can give a comment about, uh, but I will not go into it because right now what I need basically are facts. I need proofs. And here it is. I claim this to be yet another two psychologists. Uh, I am claiming I have recognized yet another two psychologists. No, uh, I am going to try to meet this individual somehow i have to remind you that two psychologists when i did what you what you have um heard i know i did because i didn't get the names of the people or anything like this they disappeared that happens in denbach near Warsaw. okay i can go out and I, I can point them out to you the people there's two psychologists that live very near the center in denbach immigration center uh, but there's nothing I can do because I don't know who the people were and people no longer, the two female ladies, psychologists involved in Kyoto, they would not reappear again. But I'm sure they would help me out because these people are good people. They're not really, uh, you know, they were not out there to make me a problem, okay? So now it's up to you. Now it's your turn uh, to keep your word, uh, Association of Psychologists in Poland. Thank you very much for watching this video. Today is October the 28th, 2018, and what I just did, played you right now, it was yesterday on the 27th on a Saturday. I was thinking about what to do with it, what should I do with it, what... I was even thinking about not doing this right now, not doing it at all, not this and that, no. Uh, my concern was the one in Denmark, that when I did this, then they disappeared. You're gonna go and you're gonna find him, no. The time to do it is now, and then the next thing is to meet the gentleman and get his confirmation about my account. Thanks for watching uh, this time. Again, bye-bye from Grotniki, Poland.